This is Orochimaru's hideout. There's no telling what sort of traps might be waiting for us. I want you exercising far more caution now. Right! So, you made it this far. Sai. You jerk! Why did you betray the Hidden Leaf? My, you realized I'd betrayed you. Good work. If you figured out that much, I assume you also know my objective? I guess. You weren't acting alone. This is your other master's agenda, isn't it? And whoever that may be, is plotting to destroy the Leaf for the second time. Well done. That's correct. We will crush the current Hidden Leaf and construct a new one in its place. Sai, doesn't it bother you to be helping with this? Not really. It is my mission after all. Why you? All right, that's enough talking, I think. I can't let you beyond this point, Orochimaru's orders. Because Sasuke is over there. <gasps> Sasuke is... I'm sorry, but I'm afraid you're going to have to disappear now. The way that leads to Sasuke is right through you! Sai, you're gonna block our way. You won't get any mercy. I can't mess around here, especially if he's waiting right up ahead. Bust my way through if I have to! Naruto... Captain Yamato, Sakura, don't interfere! I'll take care of this! Wait, there are three of us here. We'll have a better chance of moving forward if we all... Captain Yamato, please, let Naruto do this. I think there's a lot that Naruto wants to tell Sai through this fight. But... Please. <sighs> I can't give you very long. If I think you're losing, I'll step in. Right! Why? This power. Last time we fought, you weren't nearly this... I told you. I won't show mercy to anyone who blocks the way to Sasuke. I'll do whatever it takes to protect our bond. 
You're telling me that's where your power comes from? The mission is to save Sasuke! I wouldn't bother if I were you. What? When I was brought here, I met Sasuke. What? Even though Sakura told me you think of Sasuke as a brother, Sasuke told me that he doesn't care about you. So, why? Well, well. You lost pretty quickly. Kabuto Yakshi. You don't appear to have betrayed us. I'll forgive you. Why, you? <laughs> Look at your face. Glaring at me won't solve anything. Shut up! If you hadn't been eyeing Sasuke in the first place, he'd never have come here! You see, you're passing the blame. In the end, he did come here, you know. To gain the power to defeat Itachi and to steep himself from darkness. All we did was give him the opportunity. He made his own choices. You still can't understand that? <laughs> well, you never were all that bright. What was that? Give Sasuke back! It's not as simple as giving him back, really. You're way off here. Sasuke came to us of his own accord. Why can't you just accept the truth? All right, that's enough idle chat. Why don't you return Sai to us now? No way! Naruto, you seem ready to fight me, but the last battle took a lot out of you. Do you really think you can beat me? Know what you're talking about hmm? you aren't fighting naruto you're fighting me sakura i will never forgive you <laughs> it's too late for you to make a difference here you have it backwards do you really think you can win against sakura and me captain yamato let's take him down sakura we take too long others may come to his aid i'll help too no, Naruto. You just watch Sai. We sat on the sidelines before. It's our turn now. But... It's all right. I won't lose. Not to that guy. Oh, I'd rather not strike a woman, but... With a girl this stubborn? I have no choice. Why don't I teach you a little lesson? Just try it!
I never imagined you'd do so well. Now stay out of our way! Your way, huh? Especially you, Naruto. You're the most pathetic one of all. What? People change. Sasuke is no longer the boy you knew long ago. Chase dreams and ideals all you like. But sometimes, it doesn't do any good. Sasuke can't hear you anymore. He'll never return to you. Never. Huh. No matter what anyone says, he's my friend. That bond took a lot of work. So I'm gonna protect it. End of story! You really are an idiot. You have a bond? So what? Even if you do. If there is a bond, they'll get him back for sure. Huh? Isn't that right, Naruto? Yeah. Sai, what are you saying? There's a reason why Naruto and Sakura are following Sasuke with such fervor. They're desperate not to sever their bond with Sasuke. They're trying to keep that connection. I can't say I know what it means, but... I... I want to see this bond that they're trying to reel in. Sigh. So I won't let you interfere. Not anymore. Huh. So in the end, you fall on their side, huh? I thought you might be useful, but... It looks like I was wrong. Well, never mind. Either way, I know how this will end. Go on. Go waste your energy persuading Sasuke. <laughs> he got away. Naruto, about what Kabuto said. Whatever he said, it doesn't change what we have to do. We're taking Sasuke back! Yeah. But Sai, you... I don't really understand why I chose what I did. But I thought if I stayed with you, I'd discover something. <laughs> I see. Okay, Captain Yamato. Now, we just have to get Sasuke back! Right. All right, Team Seven. Resume the mission. Yes, sir. Sasuke must be just up ahead. So close. Okay, let's go, guys. Naruto, and Sakura too. That, that voice... Finally! We found you! Sasuke! Sasuke... What are you doing all the way out here? We... We came to bring you back! <laughs> Sorry. But you can't refuse. We'll drag you back if we have to. I was wondering where Kakashi was. So you're here in his place. And is he my stand-in? I want to see the bond between you and Naruto. A bond? Hmm. 
Misguided as ever. What? Having too many ties in this world will only lead you astray. It weakens one's ambition. You see, I have a different bond now. Between my older brother and me. It's the bond of hatred. I severed my bonds with you on that day three years ago. <laughs> severed your bonds? Quit talking crazy. No matter how hard you deny it, I can feel the bond between us. It's not severed. Three years ago, and right this very second, you and I are connected. Our bond, the bond I finally found with you. It's not something you can cut loose so easily. I can't turn back. <laughs> if that's how it is, I'll just have to sever that bond. Naruto. Yeah, if that's the way he's gonna be. We'll just have to take him by force! Still just a child.
<laughs> You're not bad. But the game ends here. Attitude. He... he wasn't fighting seriously? I'll erase you here once and for all. I wouldn't use that jutsu, Sasuke. <laughs> Why did you stop me? Why? I thought we'd let these young ones rid us of as many of the Akatsuki as possible. Because if other Akatsuki members interfere, it would prevent you from getting your precious revenge. That's a pitiful excuse. Every bit helps. If your chances for vengeance improve even just a little, why not make use of them? <laughs> Come, we're moving on to the next hideout. W wait, Sasuke! Naruto, like I said, he can't hear you anymore. Sasuke! Goodbye. Sasuke. Sasuke. Again. I couldn't stop him again. I am... So weak. So that's the extent of your bond. Huh? Naruto, you said something to Sasuke just now. You said even if he denied it, you could feel your bond. It bound you two, unsevered. Do you think a bond that strong will be broken by something like this? Sigh. No. Never. In that case, everything's fine. Huh? You can still bring Sasuke back. And next time, I'll be there. After all, three makes for better odds than two. Sai. Thanks. The fight's just begun. I see. So there was no hope for Sasuke. And? We're not giving up. failed technically but just look at their eyes as long as there is strength in those eyes they'll keep fighting they won't let anything discourage them what promising kids huh all right in that case i'll have you continue to carry out new missions as team seven you'll be contacted about your next mission shortly until then i want you all on standby understood I'm counting on you. Right!
Thanks for the food, Iruka Sensei. No worries. Lately, it seems like you're always buying my ramen, Iruka Sensei. Well, I can see how hard you're working. Call it a reward. Hey, so if I keep working this hard, you'll pay for my meals forever? Come on, are you trying to bankrupt me? <laughs> right then. I guess I'll head back to the Ninja Academy. What about you? I've got to go meet up with Sakura and the others. Another mission? They're really keeping you busy. Well, do your best. Yep. to keep you waiting you're late sorry sorry i was having ramen with iruka sensei honestly look captain yamato's waiting up ahead come on hurry yeah yeah uh, um naruto huh what's the matter hmm? he sounds different I mean, well, I read in a book uh, about how to make others feel at ease around you. It's said to call people by their first names, that it would breed familiarity, and might even lead to friendship. So, I, um, from now on, I was wondering if I could be less formal when I talk to you. Huh. I never knew you thought about stuff like that. You don't really have to ask, you know. You can be as casual as you want. Yeah, no need to hold back around us. Uh, okay. Thank you. All right, Sakura, sigh. Let's hurry and hear what Captain Yamato has in store for us. to you, I got a nice long break. I'm doing great. So you're the new team member. Sai, was it? Nice to meet you. Y yes, sir. Kakashi Sensei, there was something I wanted to tell you next time I saw you. Hmm? What's the matter? Why so serious all of a sudden? Listen, on our last mission we went to Tenchi Bridge, and... I know. Yamato told me everything about Sasuke, too. With my power, there's just no way. I wouldn't be able to bring him back now. Sasuke has gotten way too strong for me. Well, in that case, I guess you're gonna need to get even stronger than that. been brainstorming and uh, I have an idea in fact if this training pans out Naruto you may even surpass me hold on surpass you Kakashi sensei what are we gonna be working on we're going to create an ultimate ninjutsu just for you my own ultimate ninjutsu right actually that's one of the reasons I called you out want to try it <laughs> right now, I have to get stronger no matter what. If there's even the slightest chance it'll work, I say we go for it. Good answer. We'll use the training field. Head over when you're ready. All right. The thing is, I have to help with this training as well. While I do that... I understand. Sai and I will go perform a mission or two by ourselves. 
I knew you would. Your sharpness makes my job that much easier. Hey, Sakura, are you sure? Isn't it gonna be pretty tough with just the two of you? Well, we can't help with the training. I want to at least do this. In exchange, you make sure that your training is a success. Got it? Yeah! Well then, shall we head for the training field? Kakashi's waiting for us. Yeah! I'm gonna nail this! Here you are. Let's hurry up and get started, Kakashi-sensei! Wow, you're really raring to go. So, what do I do first? First, we check the nature of your chakra. The nature of my chakra? Uh, what's that? All chakra has one of five natures. Fire, water, earth, wind, or lightning. Well, rather than going into details, let's try this. First, we'll have a light sparring match. I'll check your nature during the fight. Got it! I see. Okay, so what nature am I? Your chakra nature is wind, a chakra nature that slashes through everything, outstanding in a fight. Oh, yeah, I knew it! I'm unstoppable! Hold your horses. We've only just figured out what it is. Now comes the hard part of learning how to properly use and control your nature. Okay, let's do it! <laughs> now then. Since Naruto's nature is wind, I know just the guy to bring in for help. Hey, come on. Let's take a break, all right? I'm beat from all this walking. We finished hunting the two tails and everything. No one's gonna care if we rest for a bit. Hey, yo, Kakazu, you listening to me? 
You talk a lot. What was that? Just be quiet and follow me, Hidan. Did you even hear what I was just saying? Did you? Stonewalling again? Shut up. Don't make me say it again. Just be quiet and follow me. Man. So, uh, where are we headed now? The land of fire. Apparently, the Nine Tails Jinchuriki is there. The Nine Tails, huh? So, another sacrifice for Lord Jashi. I'll play with him and hurt him real good before I finish him off. Being motivated is good, but don't get carried away. It will come back to bite you one day. Come on, you're telling me that? <laughs> yeah, I'm looking forward to this. Chapter 3 The Immortal Akatsuki. Darn it. Can't believe I lost again. Listen, though, next time I won't lose. I'm gonna leave you with your jaw hitting the floor. I really can't see myself losing to you and Shogi yet, Asuma. Why, you little... Are you picking a fight? Still, that was an interesting move you played. What, the climbing silver strategy? Throwing away your piece in order to infiltrate the enemy's camp? I thought you hated moves like that. Against a superior opponent, one must make some sacrifices in order to protect one's king. What's up? Nothing, really. It's just that I'm finally starting to realize the value of the king. Well, lose your king and the game is over, so... <laughs> if the Leaf Village were a game of shogi and ninja the game pieces, do you know who the king would be? Huh? Well, the Hokage, right? I used to think so, too. But it actually isn't. Then who? When the time comes, you'll know. Huh? All right. I best be off. There's something you have to do? Yeah, just some drudge work for Kakashi. I'm headed for the training field. Later. Sorry to keep you waiting. Ah, you came. Thanks for doing this. Huh? What's Asuma Sensei doing here? Asuma has a wind nature just like you. I thought he'd be useful, so I called him over. Huh? Asuma Sensei has wind nature too? Hey now, that's my line. I mean, who'd have thought you and I were the same? The same, huh? Cool! Okay, okay, I have a question then. Yeah, I'm sure you do. You probably want to know what the trick to it is, right? Yeah, exactly! Still, it's hardly a trick. 
What you have to keep in mind is incredibly simple. Split your chakra into two halves, then grind them against each other, as if you were sharpening a blade. Sharpening the blade between the two halves, huh? Well, in your case, you'd probably pick it up easier if I show you during a match. Think about what I told you just now, and come at me. Okay, I'll give it a shot! you were before. You're starting to get it, aren't you? Good. If you keep doing what you did just now, you'll develop your ability to activate a wind change. Ooh, now I've got the hang of it! Thanks a lot, Asuma-sensei! Thanks for all your help, Asuma. Naruto's really growing up, isn't he? Yes. He just keeps getting stronger. I guess that means a new era is on its way. What's wrong? Nothing. Well, I should get going. I'll buy you lunch next time, as thanks. Right. I'll be waiting, but I won't hold my breath. Oh, Kurenai. What's the matter? Something on your mind? No, nothing that serious. It's just... Ah, Naruto, huh? It isn't just Naruto. Shikamaru and the others. Kiba and his group, too. The little runts are all growing up. New generations on the rise, then? It just might be. They still have some learning to do, but they'll pick up what's left along the way. <laughs> oh, has it left you feeling a little blue? So even though you're proud, maybe you're feeling a bit lonesome, too, now? 
You could be right. So this is where you were. Shikamaru, what is it? The fifth Okagi has called an assembly. You're supposed to come up to the mansion right away. An assembly? Did something happen? Don't know. They didn't give me any details. All right, I'm on my way. See ya. Asuma. Hey, don't worry. Can't be all that serious. I'm sorry to have kept you waiting. Hmm. What's happened? The Akatsuki made an appearance in the Land of Fire. What? Apparently, while they search for Jinchuriki, they're also drawing closer to the Hidden Leaf. Then they're after. Right. Naruto, in all likelihood. So that's where we come in. I've already told Shikamaru where you're likely to encounter them. You are to head to that location and take them by surprise, hopefully taking them alive. If that proves impossible, you have my permission to kill them. Now find them. Do whatever it takes, you understand? Yes, milady. I look forward to working with you, Captain Asuma. Back at you. All right. We'll head straight for the designated location. Shikamaru, you'll be our navigator. Yes, sir. Asuma. Kurunai, what's wrong? You're leaving on a mission? Yeah. What, you're worried? Hm. Just who do you think I am, anyway? I'm not gonna mess up that easily. I know that, but... I'll be back before you know it. I know. See you soon, okay? All right, I'm off. Hmm, isn't that Asuma Sensei and Shikamaru? Hey. Well, this is rare, seeing you two together like this. It's a long story. You're going on a mission, Asuma-sensei? That's right. What about you guys? We're just on our way to meet up with Naruto. I see. Well, when you see him, tell him to train hard, all right? <laughs> of course. Later. You do your best, too. Count on it. Thanks. Alright, we should probably go too. Yes. Wow, look at him work. Hey, Sakura, Sai, what's up? Oh, are you here to cheer me on? 
No, we finished our mission, so we came to report into Kakashi Sensei and Captain Yamato. You two are doing well, aren't you? We're managing. Sai's been working really hard. No, don't listen to her. And what about you? Are you keeping up with the training? I'm getting a real good feel for the chakra nature transformation. Wow, so you're actually learning, huh? Well, keep it up. Oh, that's right. We just ran into Asuma Sensei, and he said to tell you to train hard. <laughs> Glad to hear it. Asuma Sensei really helped me out. Asuma's on a mission? Yeah, it seemed like they had just gotten it and were heading out for their destination. Well, when Asuma comes back, you should thank him again, Naruto. Sure thing. Mm, I'm hungry. Good timing. Why don't you take a break? Naruto, go get some ramen with Sakura and Sai. And, uh, we'll have him put the bill on my tab. Whoa, you mean you're treating us? That rocks! All right then, Kakashi-sensei, Captain Yamato, we're off. Keep up the good work on your missions, you two. Of course.
Kuranai Sensei, what are you doing out here? Oh, um, nothing really. Just. But you look a little pale. Kuranai Sensei? Hmm? No, no, I'm fine. Everything's fine. It is, isn't it? Asuma? Huh? Kazoo, how long have we been in the land of fire? Don't get me wrong, it's a real treat trailing you around all day, but when are we gonna find the Jinchuriki? Shut up. Just be quiet and follow me. That's cold, man. <laughs> I gotta mess somebody up soon, I'll tell you that. And I'll bet Lord Jashin's getting tired of waiting too. Once we find the Jinchuriki, you can mess him up as much as you want. Well, yeah, but... Whoa! Sneak attack successfully executed. I can't believe he walked right into it like that. It was worth the time we took to set it. Ow, 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 ow! What's going on? What? Hit Hidan. Poor work. Hey, Kakuzu! If you had time to avoid that, you could have tipped me off, too! <laughs> Serves you right for not being on your toes. What is this? What's happening? How could he walk away from that? Is it you? Did you do that? Not only was it burning hot, it completely ruined my clothes! Those headbands... You're the Hidden Leaf Ninja. And you're Akatsuki. We're under orders to restrain or destroy you. Destroy us? Hey, Kakuzu! Did you hear that? They're gonna destroy us! <laughs> they don't seem to know their place. Maybe we do and maybe we don't. We'll know until we have a go, will we? Kazoo, I'll take these guys. I've been wanting to rough somebody up. Fine. They're a bit too puny to be sacrifices for Lord Jashi, but they're better than nothing. Don't underestimate them too much. You'll get steamrolled. And I repeat, you're telling me this? Asuma. Right. Shikamaru, cover me. Izumo and Kotetsu, watch the other one. Yes, sir. <laughs> I'm gonna teach you all about pain worse than death! Don't take us so lightly. Hmm? <laughs> 
Asuma! Don't worry, it only scratched me. <laughs> Interesting. You people are pretty good. Uh, what is this guy? I felt I'd hit home. So why is he still standing? Because I'm not made like you. <sighs> but even he is human. He must have a weak point. Oh, wow, you still want to go. But to tell you the truth, I don't really feel like playing with you anymore. What? <laughs> I've already cursed you. My pain is your pain. I'll show you the pleasure between life and death. What is this guy saying? His pain is Asuma's? Huh? It, it can't be. Well, then, let's experience the ultimate pain together, shall we? Stop! <laughs> Amazing, huh? The pain of death! <laughs> That's one down. <laughs> you sure took your time. Well, he was better than I thought. I played around a little. Why? You... You filthy! Huh? What, you want me to take you down too? Perfect. The more sacrifices for Lord Jashin, the better. Real soon, you'll be. Shikamaru! Huh? We're here to help. Choji! Ino! What's this? Reinforcements? Man, all these nobodies. I'll draw them away. While I do, Ino, you treat Asuma Sensei! Right. Joji, we're buying time. Yeah! Buying time, huh? I doubt that'll help. He's already done for. Why? 
I you? <laughs> Look at those eyes. Just imagining those eyes filled with despair gives me the shivers. Wait, Hidan. I'm joining in. Huh? What? You're itching to fight too? No. You'll take too much time if you do it alone. We're finishing this fast and going after the Jinchuriki. Yeah, yeah. Okay, then. We'll keep this short. Here he comes! Man, just quit struggling, would ya? You! What are those people? It's like our attacks don't work at all! Our lives are infinite, unlike yours. What? Your defeat is already assured. Give up and die. No matter how much you resist, you're still all lambs for my slaughter. <sighs> Sir, I only need a little more time. We're just about to get to the good part. But, sir, can't you give us just a few more minutes? Enough, Hidon. Nah. What? Are they talking to somebody? We'll be back in no time. So prepare yourselves. Let's go, Hidon. That darn leader. One of these days, I'm gonna put a curse on him. They left? Shoji, forget them. What about Asuma? Y yeah! is lethal. I can't... You know. How is he? I can't heal this. You know. No. Don't. <laughs> I wouldn't make it anyway. I... I can feel it. I bet that you three can feel it too. Can't you? Asuma... I've got <coughs> something I want to tell you three. Asuma Sensei, stop talking. Choji, you know you too. Shikamaru? Listen closely to Asuma Sensei's words, they'll be his last. 
Huh? You know. Yes? You may be headstrong, but you're also a considerate caretaker. Choji and Shikamaru, they're awkward, clumsy. Watch over them. Yes? And don't you ever lose to Sakura. Not in ninjutsu or in romance. I won't. Joji, you're a thoughtful, loyal friend and a kind soul. In time, you'll become a stronger ninja than everyone else. So be more confident in yourself. Got it. And another thing, you might consider losing a few pounds. I don't know if it's possible, but I'll try to. <laughs> and finally, Shikamaru. You're razor sharp, with the instincts of a great ninja. Truly worthy of becoming Hokage, though you'd probably try to avoid it. <coughs> Since you'd find the job such a drag. Which reminds me. Remember when we talked about the king? Let me tell you who it is. Give me your ear. Uh, Asuma. You. That's why. I'm counting on you. <coughs> Shikamaru, Choji, Ino. Thank you. still had things I wanted to learn from you. You're so selfish. Right to the end. Even at the end. That's as far as we'll go for now. <sighs> You're really getting the hang of this, aren't you? <laughs> Not much longer now. It's hard to believe that Naruto is picking this up so fast. Okay, take a break now. Gotcha. After that, spar with me. I'll take a look at that power of yours for you. Let me know when you're ready. Yes, sir! Shall we start? Okay! In your mind, go over all you've experienced until now, and come at me with everything you've got. Yep! Thank <laughs> you. 
Hmm. I managed to fight pretty well. Kakashi Sensei, how did I do? Frankly, I didn't expect you to do this well. You're still the number one hyperactive knucklehead ninja. Then, you mean? Right. You're very close to perfecting it. Yes! He really is incredible. Kakashi. Izumo? I bear a message. What's wrong? Asuma Saratobi has been killed. What? Uh, Asuma Sensei? The fifth Hokage will tell you the details if you would all go to the mansion. That is all. W wait, why would Asuma Sensei. Kakashi. Well, for now, let's hurry to the fifth Hokage. Shikamaru! Oh, Naruto. Uh, listen. Sorry, I can't talk. I've got business to take care of. Business? Kakashi. Yeah.
Man, who cares about sealing the two tails? We could have done that any time. Because of that, Lord Jashin's sacrifices got away. Right, Kakuzu? Hey, say something. I can't deal with you. Let's hurry to the Hidden Leaf Village. Come on now. If you want sacrifices that badly, hunt for as many as you want at the Hidden Leaf. Oh, hey. You're right. Preach the way of Jashin to those heathens. How devoted of you. Let's go. Ready, Shikamaru? Yeah. Hold it. You going somewhere? Your mission directive still stands. I've just assembled a new team, and we're going ahead with the mission. Not without my approval, you're not. Asuma is dead. There's only three of you. The basic unit is a four-man cell. Without a squad leader... Asuma is still with us. You're after vengeance, then, aren't you? This isn't like you at all. Are you so eager to die? We're not stupid. We have no intention of running straight to our deaths, believe me. It's just... Just what? We don't intend to run away and keep on living without fulfilling our duty. We aren't going to live without meaning. Grow up, you three. The shadow of death hangs over all ninja. Some deaths may be harder to accept than others, but unless one gets past that, there can be no future. Face reality. There's three of you, okay? A full squad has... A full squad has four. Then it's all right. Right, Lady Tsunade? Kakashi? I'll take over as Team Ten's leader and go with them. Fair enough? What are you... They're going to go even if you try to stop them. Might as well send me along so I can keep an eye on them. But... And stop them from doing anything stupid. Oh, all right. As you wish. My thanks. What about Naruto? Oh, well, he doesn't need me around anymore. Plus, he's got another squad leader with him now, so... Now then, Team 10, shall we move out? Thanks, Kakashi. We owe you one. 